After Governor Hogan urged school districts to return to hybrid learning by March 1st, some counties are actually having to rethink their reopening plans. Joseph Ojo looks into how Baltimore County is planning to get children back into the classroom. Hey there, Mary. Well, BCPS has said that it has always been their plan to get kids back into the classroom. But if you ask some parents in Baltimore County, they will say that is far from the truth. The science is clear that there is no public health reason for county school boards to keep students out of schools. A strong message from Governor Larry Hogan calling on all schools across Maryland to get students back in the classroom by March 1st. I commend Governor Hogan, State Superintendent Dr. Salmon, and the Health Department Dr. Chen. For Amy Adams is with Reopen BCPS. She has three kids of her own in Baltimore County Public Schools and says school leaders have not been transparent on reopening plans. It's just really hard when we don't know what they're thinking or what they're planning and they've kind of strung us along this far. Let's take a look back. In July BCPS told students to brace for another semester of virtual learning starting in the fall. Then later, the board was supposed to present a reopening plan to return kids back to school in November. But citing rising COVID cases, a possible start date for in-person learning was pushed back to middle December. I asked BCPS if they are discussing returning students to the classroom by March 1st. A spokesperson told me BCPS has always had a plan to return students to in-person learning as soon as it is safe and healthy to do so. They say they have heard the governor's comments and are in the process of readjusting their reopening plans. I'm cautiously optimistic. Um, I can't predict what BCPS is thinking or what they'll do, and they certainly don't communicate a whole lot. And BCPS did not say that they would open, reopen by March 1st, and they also didn't give any timeline on their reopening plans. Coming, coming up at 5, we look into other districts around the area, and we look into their re, um, them rethinking their reopening plans. Joseph Ojo, Fox 45 News.